Hey, welcome to Felcraft Cast and the Hearthstone Half Hour. I'm Harry. This is a two minute deck guide and introduction to a bit of a different druid deck that has been created by a player called Source with Goblins vs. Gnomes, Hearthstone's first expansion. We're going to summarise this deck in two minutes. If after these two minutes you want to take a look at it more in a bit more length with a couple of ladder games, uh, then please take a look at the end for links to our longer half hour summary. Our two minute summary of this deck is going to start now. So, Tree Druid. This combines a little bit of what is known as Ramp Druid, um, ramping into bigger cards more quickly using cards like Innovate and Wild Growth to get you ahead so you can drop stronger cards more quickly on the table. However, this Tree Druid deck actually is named so forth because it has Tree of Life in and also combos out quite nicely with Molten Giant. So effectively you can get quite low on health, get control of the table, you can get your Molten Giants down for less mana uh, due to uh, Molten Giant costing less for each damage your hero is taken, and then once you've got your Molten Giants on the table, you can Tree of Life, get yourself right back up to full health, um, but even if your opponent is back up to full health, you have a better table position. So that's the Tree Druid piece of it. However, in here you see a lot of Ramp Druiding. Um, you can grab Innovate in the early game, uh, use Zombie Chow to trade against Aggro decks. Zombie Chow's purpose is solely to get you um, keep you in the game against Aggro, so make sure you trade against minions rather than attacking hero health uh, if you are um, playing against aggro, mulligan, try and get zombie chow in hand. Innovate and wild growth. Wild growth smooths out your mana curve and gets you further ahead if your opponent cannot counter. Innovate will help you get those big cards on the table in the mid game a lot more strongly. Use wrath mulligan for that uh, against aggro. Control minions and draw cards using it. Pick off little minions against mech mages or hunters, warlocks, zoos, anything like that. Um, there's also a little bit of a flavour in here of probably what you do. It's Sun Fury Protector you, is a single card that you can use to throw down uh, on top of any of the big mid-game cards to give yourselves tanks and protection. Get against aggro. One Savage Roar, uh, one Force of Nature in here. The dropping three Triumphs and then Savage Roaring to give you 14 damage on one turn. Sometimes you get two, two of those. Um, each in a Watcher Druid. Big Game Hunter for Control. Grove Tenter will help you ramp also. Shade of Naxxus can be thrown down excellent against Control. If they can't be removed, they can be comboed for big wins. Keeper of the Drove for Control. Lotheb, Sludge Belcher, smooths out your curve. And with Sylvanas, Boom, Ragnaros and Alexstrasza, you've got quite a heavy mid to late game as well. So, bits of Druid, um, bits of three different Druid decks you probably take a look at. Oh, and that is our two minute summary. So, you to quickly summarise, you've got little bits of Ramp Druid, you've certainly got a little bit of Watcher in terms of being able to throw out tanks, and then also uh, the sort of Savage Raw combo with Molten Giant and Tree of Life. So a little bit of a different Druid deck there for you. Um, thanks very much for tuning in to this two minute deck introduction. For a longer guide and summary and a couple of ladder games to see how this works, take a look at the left link on the left if you're on YouTube. Um, if you'd like to take a look at more two minute deck guides and summaries then click this link on the right if you're on YouTube um, if you're live on stream uh, don't forget that you can find all of our YouTube at youtube.com forward slash Falcroftcasts um, if you're on YouTube don't forget to come and join us live twitch.tv forward slash Falcroftcasts we're always going to tweet at Falcroftcasts on Twitter um, when we're going to go live so click these links on this video if you fancy seeing a bit more or seeing this deck in more length um, any comments please like rate comment tell me what I can do better in the video below so thanks very much for tuning in if you're live on stream don't go away and if you are